All right, y'all, y'all ready to record, Brandon? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe you gotta be doing the deep voice. Uh, one second, though. Let me just. Uh, how do I? There we go. Let me check my Discord real quick. Let me make sure I don't have like any pings or anything. Alright. And then once I'm sure, because every you know, running a Discord every once in a while, someone new will come in or something. Well, oh, oh my. Uh. As long as we could start about six... Oh, that's... Okay, so that's talking about DBC. Make a ban list video. Now listen to me, young man. I'm talking directly in your ear now. I need you to do me a favor. Will you do <laughs> YouTube and make a ban list about the video? If you come back at the end, then you'll be in big trouble. Wow, at least he's being very fatherly you about it. sack of little shit drippings if you don't like a wow. I swear to Hades, Satan is low-tier Kirby players. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. low-tier Kirby rude. players. Rude, very rude. Make a fucking ban list video, I won't even fucking watch it. Listen, bitch, you're gonna make a ban list video whether you like it or not. Where's the fucking ban list video? Joe, you have to make a ban list video. I will make this short and sweet. Make a ban list video. I shall amass and subject you to all world of illness. Damn it, Joe, you need to make a ban list video immediately. Make a ban list video. You're still up for... <laughs> I'm gonna have to censor that. That's, that's a hidden project coming up in the future. Ah. I'm not normally one to request stuff, but limiter removal has been removed. You better make a ban list video. <laughs> all right. Give me a ban list video or lose your kneecaps, kid. Whoa, whoa. Make a ban list video, you pineapple pizza loving son of a wall maker. Oh, that, no, that, no, no. Rude. Not even. <laughs> You'll make a ban list video if you know what's good for you. You got a gun, man. He's you got, got a gun. gun. Thanks, Ojama Lime. I see if you've not made a ban list video yet. Obviously, this is an oversight, and you need to make one right away. I've stolen all the tots from every store in the general area around you. That is really cool. Make a ban list video or I'll throw Wattapon cards on the tracks of the train. What? Okay. You're going to be no leg, Joe, if you don't make that damned ban list video. I will break your... Bang, everyone hates my kneecaps. What are you doing? We told you already, you have one job. Every single time. Or else $3 may mysteriously disappear from your Patreon. Well then, this one's not even loading. Oh, that's well, how much take, hate is filled in it. Yeah, I'll take your soul. You're expecting a new ban list, but it was me. <laughs> Deal. 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 If you don't make a video on the ban list, I'll find you, turn you into a Yugi poop, and ban you myself. Spooky ban list video threat. All right, uh, let's play the room. Do, do, <laughs> do you have a few moments? I think I need to take a look at the ban list. Uh, all right, all right. Let's let's just go ahead and close that out. So, Joe, what is the ban list? We'll just go ahead and uh, I just happened to have it open oh, right oh, here. Oh, who saw this? This isn't list. scripted at all. I, no, why would I do so? I wouldn't tell people to send me threats about the ban list. They just <laughs> all did that of their own volition. Pishaw. Um, anyway, effective uh, tomorrow. Which is, I, people are like, you're three days late. Hey, it doesn't go into effect till tomorrow. Hide your britches or something. The, uh, hide your britches, hide your pants? Yeah, so if you've never looked, I've got CB Radio here, by the way. Mm. Check out the room on my Legs Play channel if you're interested. Yeah, but, it's going to uh, be fun. Yeah, we're recording. But we're, we're going to take a moment to look at the ban list and we'll get his thoughts. Um, so if you've never seen the ban list before, it's got a whole bunch of stuff. But the remarks, if it's new... They put it over here, so yeah. that's basically what we're looking. So, fairy tale slow snow, that stank bitch finally forbidden. Which one's that one? <laughs> She's like banished seven from the graveyard to summon her. the The whole thing is it wasn't once per turn, so people would dump like half their deck in the graveyard and then like keep summoning her and like link her away and then summon, summon her, her back again. and yeah. use her as Ixie material and send her and then summon her back and then during the battle phase they summon her again and attack for an extra mm -hmm. eighteen fifty. So damn. Um, the only thing is, like, this was broken like last year and hasn't done much of anything since then, and now it's suddenly banned. Well, if it ain't broke, wait till next year. Yep. Uh, Grinder Golem was at one, now just completely banned. It's used for link shenanigans. Okay. Um, I guess there's more link shenanigans coming out soon. <laughs> Topological Gumblar Dragon. Can we just ban banned. him for the name? Yes. 
Um, <laughs> it's just... like Gambler Dragon, but it's Gumblar. But yeah, he uh, was a uh, Link Monster. Uh, if you summon a monster to it, you can discard two cards, and then your opponent must discard two cards. Again, not once per turn. And people um, had stuff where it's like, if this is sent to the graveyard, add a card from your deck to your hand. So they replace themselves, and they'll use this like twice in a duel, and then it's like, oh, you start your turn, you draw two, you draw one card, bringing your hand to two, and that's what you have to work with. Yeah. So yeah, fuck that. Um, number forty-two, Galaxy Tomahawk. Yeah. That's another thing that makes a bunch of tokens can be used for uh synchro or link shenanigans. Wasn't doing anything, but I guess they're worried about new stuff coming out. Uh, number 86, Heroic Champion Rongo Miniad. Again. The Rongo Bongo. Damn it, no. The dang old Rongo, yeah. So mm. this guy. Bongoed his last bong? He, he's a he's an Ixie monster. Okay. You can make him with up to five materials. All he's right. like level four warrior specifically. And he gets different effects depending on how many materials he has. So if he has all five, it's like, once per turn, you can wipe the field. Your opponent can't summon any monsters. It's unaffected by card effects. It has 3,000 attack, and it can't be targeted. So, yeah, that sounds like it would have been great for my so, uh, my warrior deck whenever yeah. I actually made one. If you one. could get five on the field. Oh, hell yeah, yeah, So here's yeah. the thing. You get five on the field, and then at the end of every turn, you have to detach one. So this used to be fairly, like, it was kind of cheap, but at the same time, if you spent your entire hand to make it, then, then you got cheap, you got yeah. one turn where your opponent couldn't do anything. Mm -hmm. You hit them for three thousand, and then next turn they can start trying to fight against it, and it gets weaker as time goes on. The problem is, not only can people get a whole bunch of monsters, but there's this new thing called Gossip Shadow that's like a rank three, really easy to make. Can also be made with like five materials, mm -hmm. and its effect is like you can attach it to another monster, and all its materials get attached to it as well. Oh, so it's a clip. So, first turn, yeah, first turn they would make this, and it'd have, like, eight materials. Mm -hmm. So it's like, as long as it has five, your opponent can't summon monsters. So you got three turns where you can't summon monsters. And it's unaffected by card effects, so you can't get rid of it. And you can't summon kaijus, because you can't summon monsters. So effectively, if you can get this out first turn, and that out first turn... That, yeah, you just, one, you won. You won, to, yeah. That's, yeah, so that's, that's 9,000 damage right they there. They got rid of it. it they're just done. Um, soul Charge. Summon as many monsters as you want from the graveyard and pay a thousand life points for each. High risk, high reward. Yeah. It wasn't one, they just got rid of it. Mostly because dangers have the ability to, like, every card they have draws them a card. And they also discard a card. Mm -hmm. So they would just go through their deck until they got soul charge and then summon everything back <laughs> out of the graveyard. They're like, doesn't matter if it's one, I can dig until I get to it. Yeah. So, that's they banned, what, one, two, three, four, five new cards? Oh, so that's quite a lot. And the last time they just banned like one, it was just like. Oh, okay. I thought the banned list was like 10, 15 cards each time. Uh, no. Normally it's pretty. It's like 10 cards total. Okay. This is five just on this. And spoilers, there's a lot happening. Uh, Chaos Emperor Dragon Envoy of the End was forbidden. Now it won. Old, old card. You I remember Envoy of the, the End. Yeah. yeah. It, it, it got an errata, so it's not as good. I uh, haven't even looked at it. Um,. Cyberstein, another really old card. Another Wasn't one I won, remember. Or was forbidden, now it's at one. To pay 5,000, summon a fusion monster from the extra deck. Yeah, yeah. So it's like, again, high risk, possibly, possibly high, high reward. reward. Yeah. I don't know, people are saying now, it's like, there's so many hand traps, and you have to pay before you do anything, so it's like, yeah, you can pay 5,000, but if you get hit by Effect Veiler, you're going to have a bad time. You're just screwed. You're you just, just paid $5,000 yeah. for... It's like paying a five thousand like a seven hundred thousand dollars for a daewoo. Like, yeah. why did you do that? Uh, Dark Greffer at one. This is a guy. He lets you uh, send a dark monster from your deck to the graveyard. I remember. I think I had Dark Greffer. Yeah, at one there, there's a whole bunch of things now with dark warriors where people can like spam out stuff by putting things in the graveyard. Yeah. So they hit him to one. So they reduce the consistency on that. Um, sure it, strategist of Necroz. Was forbidden, now back at one. They're bringing Necrols back, baby. Yeah, They're I remember that was anymore. fun when it came out. That that actually, I a lot of people complained about it, but I thought Necrols was one of the more fair decks you could play against. Okay. They, they, unless they hit you with uh, the Dijin, which is like a thing, like if you use it as ritual material, you can't, your opponent can't special summon. Yeah. But it's like, unless they hit you with that, it was very much like, 
I'll make this, and it'll discard a card, or it'll do a thing, or get rid of a guy. But you never, you didn't lose in one turn. It it was very toolboxy. Yeah, kind of, kind of like uh, it did, heroes. It didn't o it didn't OTK you, and it didn't lock you down from playing. It was like a lot of back and forth and searching and stuff. Sometimes that can be the most dangerous decks, I believe. Yeah, that's that's the same reason. Uh, spoiler alert: Sky Strikers have not been hit on this list. A lot of people are upset because it's one of the better decks. But again, like. Sky Strikers are powerful, but I never feel like I'm. They're cheap. Yeah, like you're being oppressed. Yeah, yeah they're, like... they they're a lot of back and forth. You have many turns with Sky Strikers because they only summon one monster that has like two thousand attack at most. So normally you're gonna get like three four turns to fight against Sky Strikers. You mm -hmm. have a chance. Um, Use it. El Shadal Construct was limited. Now back at one. They freed Shadals. A lot of people are really happy about that. Uh, a lot of people really like Shadals, and their boss monster has been on the ban list for a while. Mm -hmm. Is that their boss monster? Yes. Ah. She is like, if she attacks a... Uh, you remember what Cataster was from when you played, right? I remember Cataster. It's like if it attacks anything but a dark monster, it just instantly destroys yeah, yeah. it. She's that, but for special summoned monsters. Wow, that's even more... Uh, yeah. Yeah, and she has like 2800 attack, I believe. And also, El Shadal Fusion, the fusion that they use to make it, mm -hmm. is like, if your opponent has an extra deck monster, you can fuse using monsters from the deck. So the thing is, you can play three copies of Fusion, and just play, like, one Shadal and one light monster in your deck to use as material, and sort of tech this out. So they're like, I don't think Shadals are going to come back in the meta, but people might play Construct as, like, a side deck card. Oh, it was, it was Forbidden, now it's up yeah, to... Yeah, now it's to one. Now it's to one, okay. Now you can play the one... Um, Brilliant Fusion, now at one, used to be at three. Gem Knight FTK taking a hit. Uh, also, it gave you another normal summon. People use it outside of that because there's a Gem Knight you could summon that gives you another normal summon. Yeah. And uh, a lot of people use that just so they get more monsters on the field. They played the one Gem Knight in it. Um, but yeah, now it's uh, now it's at one. I, I remember Gem Knights not being too spectacular. They weren't too good, but they got a card last year that allowed them to FTK. Uh -huh. Where they I'm, could just do burn damage in first turn and kill you before you got the chance to play. Yeah, I remember having the first Ixie that I was just like, yeah, that's a, that's a lot Gem of damage. Gem Knight Pearl. Yay. It's a lot of damage. Yeah, yeah. what else? No, nothing? Yeah. That's nice. Uh, yeah. Gold Sarcophagus. Back at one. Was it three? This was at one for a long time, and then they took it off, and now Thunder Dragons are really good at banishing stuff, so they put it back on there. Ah. Um, Magical Midbreaker Field, which is interesting because as far as I know... This wasn't seeing a whole lot of play. Ah. This is a it's a field spell that says like during the main phase, uh, neither player can target monsters with card effects. Mm -hmm. So what you do is you play it, and it's like, well, you can't target your opponent, but you can play it first turn, do all your plays, and don't have to worry about uh, like hand traps targeting your stuff. Okay. And then okay. you can just get rid of it somehow. So they put that at one. So probably not going to be played there. Uh, scapegoat at one. Another Wait. card. Oh, that yeah. one. Everybody knows Scapegoat. Yeah. That guy's getting the, back, huh? The, the, it was at three. Ah, okay. So they, they, Yeah, they had it at two last time, and now they brought it back down to one. So they brought it back, and then Lynx came, and you can use Lynx. It's like, hey, you got four monsters. You can Guess what? You a bunch of things. Ha -ha. Now they're at one. No, that's they also, because they changed the meta back to being like, uh, oh, you said Lynx? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I was thinking. Uh, Link monsters are like Synchros, except you don't need specific levels, mm -hmm. if yeah, you're yeah. unfamiliar. Yeah, you know, no, I... I I'd forgotten about that. I thought you were talking about when Ixies had come out, where you're just like... Oh, yeah, when Ixies came out, they brought Scapegoat back because you couldn't use them as Ixie material. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can't? Yeah. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. Yeah, tokens, that... tokens can't be used as Ixie material. Mm -hmm. They can be used as Link material, so now we're at one. Uh, Slash Draw at one. There was an FTK with that. Slash Draw is this really cheesy thing where it's like you you play it, and then you mill cards up to the number of cards on the field, mm -hmm. and then draw one card. And if it's slash draw, you destroy the whole field and do 2,000 to your opponent for every card on the field. Damn. Yeah. It's a lot, but it's like in order to do that, you need to have, you need to basically draw into slash draw after milling however many cards you have on the field. You need to have the heart of the cards. So. Yeah, but they're, they're basically, there's a card that lets you, uh, called Saryuya, that's like draw four and then put three on top of your deck. Mm -hmm. So it's basically draw one, but it lets you stack your deck. Yeah. And so they can do stuff with, like, they'll inflict 2,000, put three monsters on the board, do Saryuya, slash draw, and then they take 6,000, and that's game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So they put it at one, so you literally can't resolve it now. Uh, it's only useful now is, what was it, you mill the cards if you draw it and you don't get slash draw, 
all the card. what was it? You have to put cards from your graveyard back into your deck equal to the number you milled. But it doesn't have to be the same cards you milled. So it lets you shuffle your graveyard around. You could put stuff you used back and put other things So it's in. really a no-lose situation on that. Yeah. you. It, well, I mean, it depends if you have a graveyard you want to really fix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. at one, it's useful for, like, fixing your graveyard for recycling things. Mm -hmm. But you're not going to be able to FTK with it anymore. Yeah, it, it's not a beat stick. It's just a good utility now. Yeah, it's just a neat one-of utility. And yeah, that's... Let's see. One... Two, three, four, five new things that have been limited that were at mm -hmm. three, and one, or no, one, two, three, four things they brought off of the list. All right. So they're doing a pretty good job of, like, they put ten things on the list and brought four off. Um, Semi-limited list. Very short. No new additions. And finally, <laughs> everything that's no longer on the list. Insector Hornet. No oh, no. Limited. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, so Inzec I'm excited to play Insectors again, or at least try them out. They still have other cards on the list. I'm going to stay away from Yu-Gi-Oh! still. <laughs> I'm, I think I'm going to... I'm not even sure if it'll still be good in this day and age. We'll see. It's Back a... in my day, though. Yeah, it, when you and I first started playing Locals, that Insectors were like... like that, no. Yeah. yeah. Guess what? I'm going to do this, 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 the and this. The big thing is their loop requires uh, Insector Dragonfly. And it's not off? It's, yeah, it's at one. Ah, okay, okay. Hornet is the one in the graveyard. It can still do some stuff, but you can't... Basically, Hornet, you detach to destroy something. Mm -hmm. Dragonfly says if something's detached, summon a monster from the deck. So what you could do is, like, Sh Dragonfly, shuffle. you destroy, get another Dragonfly, destroy, get another Dragonfly. So not only were you destroying, like, four things, <laughs> but you were getting four monsters. Now you have Hornet, so you can destroy things more easily, but you can't summon a bunch from the deck. It can, it's just, fly. it's a glass cannon now, yeah. so it's not as uh, recyclable as before. They do have a Link monster now, though, so, I don't know, we'll look. Uh, Necrols of Brionic, which was their searcher, was at one, and now it's no longer on the list. So more Necrols. Uh-huh. Hey, they've also got new stuff that helps rituals in general called incantations. So my, uh, Brionic, so all, all the Brionic versions are back. Yeah. 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 All Brionics are back. I, I, hey, it was the dragon I wanted to have when I was uh, uh, starting out. Evil Swarm Exiton Knight was it one. It wasn't really doing anything. I, yeah. I can't imagine most people would play more than one, so it doesn't matter. Was Evil Swarm big when it came out? Because I don't. Yeah, remember. but Exiton Knight, he's a he's an Ixie monster that says if your opponent has more monsters than you, detach, destroy all their field. Okay. And they take no damage this turn. So it's like a recovery card. If you're down to like two things and your opponent has a board. Exiton can level the playing field by blowing up their whole board. Okay, yeah. But it's something you play at one of, really. Kind, and, yeah. kind of like Black Rose? Yeah, it's Black Rose and Ixie form, essentially. Okay, yeah. The only difference is you have to be behind in order to use it. Because you have to, your opponent has to have more cards. So it is a clutch card specifically. Specifically. Okay. Yeah. They took it out when at the end of Ixy format because it was so powerful. <laughs> full, yeah, at the start of Pendulums because Pendulums need all that field set up. And yeah. Like, if you could wipe that, your your opponent's doom. So then they brought it back. Now it's at one. Uh, interrupted Kaiju Slumber. That's going to be a big one. Back at three. This is a dark hole. But four. Essentially. Not not even four kaiju. It's dark hole, and then you summon a kaiju to each side of the field from your deck. Oh, so it's literally just like it's a, screw the world, two kaiju's fight. Yeah. All and right. so, but people mostly use it like you know you're gonna win that fight because you're gonna have a, kai, a kaiju in your deck that's weaker and one that's stronger. Mm -hmm. So mostly it's just the fact that like now we have more board wipes. Yeah. And you can play more kaiju's. Uh, the monarch storm fourth, the thing that lets you tribute your opponent's monsters, was at one, not really played. Now it's at three again. So I now don't like monarchs that. monarchs have a thing. I don't yeah. like that. I, I I remember that that card pissed me off the, more the, often than the, not. The meta right now is shifting more towards, instead of getting big boss monsters, it's swarms of monsters again. So this really helps to get rid of things. There, there, usually just, it juggles between the two, doesn't it? Yeah. Boss well, monsters. Well, no, it juggles between, the, you get boss monsters, then you get swarms of monsters, then you get, like, spell traps are really, really powerful, mm -hmm. and then you start getting into really heavy negate stuff. I find that's, like, the four... The f turnings that you get. The four the dots four on the wheel. Yeah. Um, and we're just getting out of a thing where it's like everything was just locking you down. Yeah. They That's the thing. They hit all the lockdown stuff, but they kept stuff like Sky Striker's fine, which is more toolboxy. It doesn't lock you down. Um, they also gave us Eradicator Epidemic Virus. Uh, which that's is, a mouthful. Yeah. that's You tribute like a dark monster with 2,500 attack, and then you pick spells or traps. It destroys all of whatever you pick that your opponent has and in their hand 
for the next three turns. So it's essentially the uh, what Crush Card Virus is, is for just Monster. For, for spells yeah, and traps. Yeah. So people are saying this. They didn't hit Sky Strikers. Instead, they gave us this. Because if you can use this on Sky Strikers, they're mostly spells. Mm -hmm. You could completely destroy them if you resolve Eradicator Epidemic Virus. All right. Uh, Infernity Barrier. Because Infernities needed to be powerful again, I guess. Uh, uh, why? I don't know. Wind Up Magician wasn't two. They took it off. Wind Ups aren't really doing anything. They used to be able to loop with an Ixie they have, but they don't have Zing it anymore. Main? Or Zen Main? No, or... uh, Zen Mighty. Zen Mighty? Oh, okay. Zen Mains is just a nice defensive wall, or it was. Um, TG Hyper Librarian, no longer on the list. I think I had that at one point. Yeah, it's harder to synchro spam. There's new TG support. Ah, nice. They just released TG, so that's probably why that's... And Limiter Removal! Ha! Ah. the list! <laughs> because trains didn't OTK enough. <laughs> they already have a monster that can attack for 6,000. Why not make it 12,000? You know what? You're right. Yeah. <laughs> Let's no, go. Let's do this. So there's the list. That took longer than most of mine. but That's because you have know. a co-host and you have to explain yeah, some of it. Yeah, you'll have to comment in the comments whether or not you like my normal, like, super fast where I just go through it really quick. Or if you like having Brandon here so I could explain mm. so I could explain everything like like I was Hard explaining Hard-legged novice child. here. Yeah. yeah. What the card, What's hard card? day? Yeah, some people like explanations, some people don't. Honestly, I, I like... Normally, when I make a ban list video, I'm just, like, making fun of the fact that everyone's like, Oh, this is out. Oh, they just, you're doing yeah, it. They really, just, you're doing it. Limited has been removed. It's just sort of like, oh, this is this. This was the means. Yada, mm -hmm. yada. I just go yeah. through really quick. Um, but with you, it's more explanation for yada people rada, who want an explanation. Rada. So, yeah. Uh, thanks to every patron who sent me a message. And uh, until next time, good luck. Have fun. Mm -hmm. And drink, have have drink, fun. Drink tots. Yeah. Drink. Drink. No. 